Okay, here we go. We start off with the probability that someone ordered a McChicken is 0 0.28. So we call that a C, or a C dash, and it's 0 0.28, so this is 0 0.72. The next thing we know is that if they order a McChicken, the probability that they order a thick shake is uh, 0 0.2. So T, or T dash... It's 0 0.2, 0 0.8. Now, we don't know enough to fill in this side yet, but we will be able to soon. All right. Now, we know that our total for, uh, for thick shakes is 0 0.12. So what we're going to do, first of all, is we're going to work out this 0 0.2 times 0 0.28, which is 0 0.056. So this is CT is 0 0.056. Right. Now we know that the T's all combined have to add up to one, uh, 0.12. So what we've got left here is this one here has to be 0 0.064 so that they add up to 0.12. That's C dash T. Right? That's a really helpful step. Okay, so to figure out what the probability is here for, for this one here, to the, the conditional probability, what we have to do is we've got to work backwards. We know that the total equals uh, 0 0.064. Right, so we know that 0.72x equals 0.064. And so what we can do by doing a little bit of rearranging, a little bit of algebra, we get x equals 0.064 divided by 0.72, which means that x equals 0 0.089 or 889 89 will do two significant figures is fine 0 0.089 right which means that here the conditional probability is 0 0.911 All right, so putting that into play, then we can then work out C dash T dash. Uh, and we know that that one equals 0 0.656. And we can also do C T dash. which is 0 0.224. Okay, so once we've got that, we now have enough information to be able to answer our questions. Right. The first question that we had was to answer what the probability was that someone did not order a thick shake or a McChicken. And the answer to that one is this, uh, this number here. So that's neither a thick shake or a McChicken. The next one said, in the next 40 customers, how many would order a thick shake but not a McChicken? So we want a T, C dash, which is this one here. Actually, I'll do that in a different color. Right, and we've got to multiply that by 40, um, which works out to, let's put it in the calculator, 2.24. So we'd expect that about two out of the next 40 customers would order a thick shake, but not a McChicken. Hope this helps.